The foreign ministers of Arab countries have come together to criticize the United States' recognition of Jerusalem as the capital of Israel. After hours of talks at an emergency meeting in Cairo, they agreed on a resolution to reverse the decision. Condemnation is coming not just from the Arab League, but from around the world. Pak Hee-jun has the details. The Arab League has slammed the United States' decision to recognize Jerusalem as Israel's capital, saying it's a violation of the international law and of world peace. At the emergency meeting at the Arab League headquarters in Cairo, Egypt, the foreign ministers of the 22 countries adopted a two-page resolution demanding that the U.S. reverse the decision. The Arab League Secretary General said U.S. President Donald Trump's decision raises questions about America's ability to support peace in the Middle East. The decision is a waste of international legitimacy and the principles of justice, and therefore has placed the person who made the decision in a state of conflict with the collective will of the international community. Although the resolution did not include any sort of economic sanctions, it urged the UN Secretary General to adopt a resolution condemning President Trump's decision. Many in the international community have been protesting since Friday in reaction to the decision. The rage was apparent not only in Jerusalem, but also in other parts of the world, including Arab and Muslim nations such as Egypt, Turkey, Malaysia and even New York. At least four people have been killed and dozens injured since the announcement. Two Palestinians were killed in the latest Israeli airstrike on the Gaza Strip on Saturday that injured another 25 Palestinians. And on Friday, the Red Crescent said it had attended to almost 800 injuries in the occupied West Bank, East Jerusalem and the Gaza Strip. Park Hee-jun, Arirang News.